The use of captive insurance companies can be traced back to the 1920s. The captive boom started in the 1970s in the United States. Most early captives were in offshore jurisdictions, such as Bermuda, because those jurisdictions had captive insurance legislation in place. But in recent years, many states in the U.S. have passed captive insurance legislation. The growth of captive insurance and related risk transfer mechanisms is driven by businesses seeking to better manage insurance needs, including cost, coverage, service, and capacity. When segregated cells, risk retention groups, and rent-a-captives are included, the number of captive and alternative risk arrangements today is in the tens of thousands and is rapidly growing. The market for alternative risks, including captives, is very large, far exceeding $100 billion of annual insurance premiums. It is estimated that there are over 6,000 captives today, with more being formed each week.